Welcome back to DIY December. If you're someone that doesn't really enjoy gift wrapping slash wrapping paper is not your BFF, then this video may be really helpful for you. At least I hope so. I'm gonna be showing you some really easy ways to wrap presents that involve things that you probably already have laying around your house and none of them involve wrapping paper. Yeah, yeah. First up, Ah, foil. There's so many uses for foil, but did you know you can wrap gifts in foil? And the great thing about foil is you can use the shiny side or you can use the side that's a little less shiny. It has like more of a satiny finish to it. And you can wrap foil around anything. So if you have something that's a weird shape that you need to wrap, foil will work with pretty much anything. So I'm just gonna wrap this box up. you can just use whatever ribbon you want. So I'm gonna start off maybe with this red ribbon. I cut the red ribbon to the length that I want it to be and now I'm going to take this sparkly one and make it the same length. I want this side of the box to be the top, so I'm going to turn it over and lay it on the ribbon. And then I'm gonna wrap the ribbon around it just like I would with any other present. You create a little crossover on the bottom, flip it over and bring it up. And then you just kind of fluff the bow so it looks how you want it to look. Cut off any excess here. And then you have your wrapped little gift. This is awesome because you can literally use whatever ribbon you want. You can even use like the little fluffy stick on ribbons and just stick one on the top and you can use any colors that you want to. We're gonna move this guy off to the side because it's time for... Do you have toilet paper in your home? Well, that means that you probably have some toilet paper rolls. And you can turn them into pillow boxes, starting off by smashing them. Now flipping it over on its side, I'm just gonna bend it in like this and create a little fold. Oh my gosh, look, it's working. <laughs> this makes me so happy. <laughs> now that I have this end folded, I'm just gonna tape it like that. So at this point, you would want to put your present inside because otherwise you're just gonna seal up your box and not have a present in it. But this is great if you have like a little gift card that you're giving someone, some jewelry, anything that's small and will fit inside. When I taped this side up over here, I made a note that I wanted this to be the bottom. So over here, I'm gonna fold these flaps so the extra tape also ends up on the same side. And there you go, now you have a little pillow box. You can do whatever you want. You can paint this, you can wrap this in ribbon, you can put stickers all over it, you can do whatever you want. But I'm gonna take this ribbon because I think it's really pretty and I'm going to wrap it around like this to kind of create a little base here. And I'm gonna tape the ribbon down. So all of the tape is happening in the back and the front stays nice and pretty. I really like a layered look, so I'm gonna also take this twine and have it go around. And this is also gonna help keep this together in the back. This twine is really pretty too because it has little silver threads weaved in, so it gives it more of a festive feel. I'm gonna trim the little edges off. This is so cute, I'm so happy with this one. And there you go. Your little pillow box is ready to go. I love that these pillow boxes are not only super cute, but they're also eco-friendly too because you're reusing your toilet paper rolls and giving them a whole new life. And now you are about to see my personal favorite way to wrap presents. Oh, Ingrid, why do you just have a boring paper bag out? Well, it's because I have almost 2,000 Lisa Frank stickers that I am literally just going to cover the paper bag in. This is gonna be awesome. Look at all these stickers. Oh my God, it's like a paradise. I really have no method here. I'm just going to cover the entire bag in stickers and just kind of lay them on top of each other. And the great thing about using stickers is you don't have to use Lisa Frank stickers. You can really get whatever kind of stickers suit your personality, but I feel like obviously Lisa Frank is perfect for me. And here 
we have our glorious gift bag. I decided to completely cover the front and the back and then leave the sides bare aside from the accent unicorns down at the bottom. And now to see all of our prezzies together, we have holiday flair that can also fit any shape, rustic sweet, and then we have just straight up crazy town over here and it's amazing. If you try out any of these wrapping techniques yourself, make sure you send me photos on Twitter and Instagram. I will have my links down below. And if you wanna check out any of the other DIY December videos that I've posted so far, I will also have a link to where you can find those as well. Until I see you again the day after tomorrow, I hope you all are having a fabulous, wonderful, Lisa Frank filled day. It's giveaway time. If you would like to win these four products from the Body Shop line and their vitamin C line, all the instructions and rules that you need to know will be down below in the description box. So go check that out if you want these little orange buddies in your life. So I guess uh, this is where I just slide out of your DMs. <laughs> can you still see me? Oh, you can still see me.